Hundreds of Syrian refugees are now sleeping on the streets of the Turkish city Istanbul, some in makeshift tents and some fending for themselves with no shelter at all. I caught up with these refugees to find out why they were not in one of the several refugee camps on the Turkish border with Syria. The refugees were extremely hesitant to speak, but when they did, it became apparent that they supported the government of Syrian President Bashar al-Assad. But it was also very clear that they were afraid to say it while on Turkish soil. We were all in the Syrian army. One day my children will be in the army too. They destroyed our country. When we arrived at one of the parks that the refugees were stationed at, along with their children, one man threatened to break the camera if we continued filming. He said this was because several news outlets had been there before and lied about their story, making the refugees appear to be on the side of the foreign-backed opposition, currently fighting the Syrian government. We are with Syrian President Bashar al-Assad. We'll follow him to the end and we'll get Syria back. Refugees like these can be seen all over Istanbul. Most of them say they arrived only a few months ago and that they are scared to sleep in the refugee camps along the border because of their support for the Syrian government. They say they would rather sleep in the street than be killed in the camps. As you can see, these people are literally living on the streets with light mattresses and some blankets. With no legitimate sturdy shelter over their heads, one can only wonder how they will survive as harsh winter is approaching in Istanbul. Serena Shim, Press TV, Istanbul.